Welcome to the Freddie and Paul show. Hey, uh, what's happening, y'all? One love. I think this is episode 38. 38 coming up. And we're here at Living Stones. Yep. And we've got Nancy on today again. Nancy, Nancy. And uh, what are we going to talk about today, Fred? Well, first we're going to talk about the sermon, and then we'll talk about football. Okay, first we'll talk about the okay. sermon, then we'll talk about football. Okay. What I got out of the sermon is Bathsheba was a lady, right? <laughs> Bathsheba was a lady. Okay. Yes. And, and... Jezebel. Jezebel, right? Jezebel. Jezebel. Not Jezebel, but Jezebel. No, Jezebel. 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 Okay, okay. She was another lady, right? Yeah, she was Bathsheba another lady. and Jezebel. Now, were they good friends or something? No, they lived at different times. Oh. I, was, I was making the comparison between David and Ahab, uh -huh. and the situation with Naboth was kind of like David and Bathsheba. Okay. So, I got it. Ahab and Naboth and David and Bathsheba. Okay. Cause David, because David liked Bathsheba, right? David liked Bathsheba. Bathsheba. Yeah. That's right. But she was married to she was married to Uriah. What? Yeah. He was so David liked an, another woman that was already married? That's right. Well, what kind of junk is that? That's player hating. That's <laughs> that's adultery. That's stupid. <laughs> why would someone do that? Well, you know the story. So then, there's other fish so in then the they... sea. That's why we're fishers of men. Okay. <laughs> Unfor Both like that. Unfortunately, this is still going on. <laughs> oh. Well, anyway, uh, what I wanted to know is is was was. Was Bathsheba? What happened to Bathsheba after? Was she still? Was he? Was she still with David, or was she with? Well, well so David had Uriah, her husband, killed to cover what? up the pregnancy. And then they got. I know married it's like Jerry Springer, that? and they got married after that. And That's she. That's stupid. And she was the mother. God don't like ugly, Paul. <laughs> she was the mother of Solomon. Oh. Okay. I get it. So what else went on with this? Like you were saying in the sermon, basically you were saying, well, I don't know if you said treat others the way you want to be treated, but they weren't treating others the way you want no, to be treated. No, they sure weren't. Because they weren't living the Christian holy life. No, they sure weren't. Yeah. They sure weren't. Any, any thoughts you had on the sermon, Nancy? Yeah, well, basically, ahead, I'm going to take it from where you were. Ahab, okay, wanted Naboth's land. Okay, I get that. Because the lamb was worth a lot. Well, Jezebel. Yeah, because it was right next to his palace. Yeah. Wealthy. Jezebel right. said, well, we're going to get that land. Uh -huh. And so he, she had invited everybody to come into the city. Oh, boy. And then they, they said. She'd be talking. He said. <laughs> they, Jezebel said that Naaman was corrupt and did not like God. Mm -hmm. And so, in that time, you didn't like God, I guess you were maybe stoned or something. I don't know what. Yeah, because God... Jezebel found two false witnesses to say that, that Naboth cursed God and the king. And so then they had him stoned. And then they were jealous. Well, well, they they had they were jealous. They had him stoned, and then Ahab took the land. We're talking okay, the I got word. It. He, uh, Pastor Paul, was talking the word yes. corruption. Corruption, okay? okay. Corruption, and so Ahab, Jezebel got the land for Ahab, so oh. he had the land. Oh. And then Did they water he repented. Lot, like, he repented like in sackcloth because he knew you know, he like had been corrupted. No, it was a vineyard. Vineyard. So oh, you know how so vineyards grapes, look like right. grapes. That's yeah. right. That's right. And they made wine out of that, huh? That's right. You coming on the show too, Carmen? No. Oh wow. Oh, the oh you what? Come, on. come on. You can come on. Come on. What about the I don't, I don't know. know. You don't just, have to say anything. You just, just you just show up on camera. Here. You just and I'm going to introduce. You can just say hi. Okay, hi. this is Carmen that's, Cole, one of my friends for <laughs> almost 50 years. Oh boy. My aunt, aunt Carmen, my aunt Carmen. Yeah. In God's way. Uh huh. Because we're all plentiful. <laughs> I don't and know what that means. So anyhow, uh, yeah. You want to say anything? She don't know. Well, what we're talking I don't know who, who am I talking to. Well, you're talking to Freddie. Often talks to kings and I, everybody watches our show, right, Fred? Right. Canada. Oh. Canada. Michigan. Michigan. 
Sacramento. Uh, Freddie and did Freddie and Paul show is almost famous. We 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 are celebrities. Well, it's nice to be on your on. Your nice, Paul. yeah. This is like the late night show Paul's on David show. Letterman. That's. that's oh, really? <laughs> no joke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So who's gonna get, who's gonna do good on um, basketball this year, uh, Carmen? I don't know. I haven't watched Warriors? too much of the sports lately. Curry, right? Good, right, Paul. Steph Curry, Curry he'll Steph do well. Curry. Steph Curry and Thompson. Good. That's right. Nina and never shows up on our show. No, nah, she she's never a player shows hater. up. She's a player hater. Oh, okay. that's good. Anyways, I'm just I playing. Want, I want to ask for you. Oh, okay. Uh, let's talk to talk to Marshall. Ask okay. Marshall if she's got one. Marshall's here? Uh, Marshall's not here. Oh. But, Anyways, but I don't know where she I keeps I think them. the Warriors are going to do really good this year, Mom. Director is. Yeah. Um, they got Curry, they got Thompson, and they got Durant. Well, they did Kevin real. Durant. They did real well they last some year. Yeah. They win? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. They did the whole thing against Cleveland Cavaliers. Right. Do you know that we're the Cleveland... Falling, we're falling you know, apart here. No, I'm good. I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm Carrying it Anyhow, on. Cleveland Cavaliers on. got Isaiah Thomas from the Celtics. No joke. Really? Yes, the point guard. Yeah. You know what I'm Who talking about? He used to be in Isaiah. Sacramento. Yeah, and they got rid of him for for some ungodly way. I don't know why they did that. Is that politics or what? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> all I know, apart. all I know is they should have kept him and they should have kept Cousins too, but. You know, maybe they could they couldn't grasp the wealth because they couldn't afford them. You okay. Know? Okay. Anyways, basically what I wanted to say is, um, who do you have today, Mom? I know Reggie said you had Fitzgerald, you had um, Rosenberger, and you'll be playing your son today. I found out. I'm playing Jared today. Jared. Jared was talking to me. He's a very nice individual, and I like to talk on this show because it makes me feel good. And when I perform, when I perform, Paul, I usually have a cup of coffee so I can perform at my total velocity of the secondhand motion. I, that sounds like a performance-enhancing drug. That on. caffeine is a performance-enhancing drug. Is that what no, you're saying, no, Fred? No, 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 no. It just keeps me going because I, I, I no, love that's... to feel the crowd. When I went to Philadelphia and I performed, I had one soda, and man, man, am I just, I was just working it man my stuff was on hit man i couldn't quit man i had the crowd going go freddy go freddy and i was busting rhymes paul and that's when you came pick me and cj up at, at the, the airport. airport yeah i remember but that. but i didn't like the flight because it was a long flight and then like you were saying in the in in bible study today they changed our flight because i didn't know which flight to go to but i thought it was wrong and CJ got mad at me because we had to change flights. And what happened is, but everything worked out to be good. So, everything worked out fine. Okay, well, this was a good show. And <laughs> I hope you guys tune in because we are comedians of Sacramento and Michigan and what else? Canada. And Canada. And not to mention, um, I am having a good day and I hope my day goes good. And I think I'm going to go to Costco and... Um, have a Polish dog and a soda for lunch. Now, you guys understand that everything's fine and my mom is doing good. And she's a good American citizen. And I <laughs> think and I think football will do good today. So let's close the show. This was a very nice show. We'll do the show again next week or the week following. And thank you for tuning in. Do you have anything to add? No, I think that was a good show. All right. Well, we we love everybody out there, and we 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 treasure your comments. So go ahead and comment to Paul what you would like us to talk about, and we can do that because this is the Freddie D and Paul show, and we got it going on in the night. We gotta land the plane here, Fred. And I'm gonna land the plane right now. And we all put one love up. Ready? All right. One, here we go. two, three. No, the other hand, Mom. Because that's not the L. You gotta put the L up. One that? love. Amen. Hallelujah. Christian Foreign Church up in this. Yeah, boy.